Once I went to the fridge to eat plums. Yes, here we go again. Lift the jug and fill my mouth with that thick, sweet plum. <coughs> this isn't plums. This is... <coughs> my mouth is full of leftover blobs of old slimy mustard. <coughs> I looked in my pockets. I looked in my shoes. I looked in my socks. I looked in my jumper. Down my jumper, down my shirt, in my armpits. I even looked under my fat banana. It's gone. The plum's gone. A whole plum doesn't just disappear. What am I going to do? I thought, Haribo. Would you believe it, the little pig? And the fridge door's jammed. I'll have to break it down. God, when I get Haribo. Oh, he's going to be in for big trouble. And there's my dad, and he's standing there all shaky and sorry and shuddery. And he just fell over and gave me and my brother a red shoehorn each. Hmm. Later that day, I put notices all round the school loo saying that I was going to murder Haribo really hard and fast. And that's when I get into really big trouble. Stop. Right there, said security guard. Murder. Haribo is cruel. Murder. Haribo is murder. You can't murder. Haribo. Now I'm angry. I am angry. So I say, what shall I say? I say, shut up, stinky, sloppy, slippery, soggy, horrible, to keel over and die. It was out prison. That's a shame. Now I'm on the floor roaring. It was then I noticed Shram and Sheddle, and Sheddle snarled, Bram, 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 Shram. And I didn't know what to say. Bram, 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 Bram. Hmm. Later that day, Bram, 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 Bram. right, that's enough. Later that day, playtime, we all went on to the playground and I said, right, who wants to go? Ah, don't pull my hair, he's punching me, Sheddle. That's really dangerous, you know. Ow, that hurt. I didn't hurt you. It was out prison hot spittle. Now I on the bed roaring. It was then I noticed the Haribo opposite. All his clothes were torn. There was plums on his face and he screamed, I want some crisps. It was then Haribo noticed me. And then that really does it. His eyes pop out. He flaps his hands. He blows, he puffs, he yells, he bobs his head up and down. He spits, spits a plum all over his plate and he turns to me and he goes, Look, um, when you go to the fridge tonight, there'll be leftover blobs of old mustard stuck to the bottom. Right! You haven't eaten the whole of the rest of the plum, have you? Haribo said, I don't know. You don't know. Prick. You don't know. I don't believe a word of it. And I ran and ran and jumped on Haribo. And he just fell over and died. Hooray! Bram, bram, bram. Shut up, Shram.